Summer is right around the corner and a new bill making its way through the state capitol is hoping to cut down on heat deaths. In particular, ones that happen inside of mobile homes. That's where nearly half of last year's heat deaths happened. Fox 10's Brian Webb has the details. An AC window unit used to sit right here in the front window in the shade pointing straight back, just like Richard likes it, until he was forced to move it around to the side. I had put a curtain up because now I can't cool the whole trailer the way it's at. I can barely cool just the, the, the front. I cool real good. The kitchen, eh, but I can't cool the hallway anymore. Now Richard says it takes a patchwork of fans to cool his place, barely, and he believes about a dozen other residents were forced to do the same. He says management calls it an attractiveness issue. They told me you couldn't see an air conditioner from the road. But there are plenty of air conditioners. But there's, the if you walk, drive around this park, there's at least 10 or 15 of them in the front of their homes. According to ASU research, 146 indoor heat deaths were recorded in Arizona in 2023, and 40% of those were in mobile homes, even though mobile homes make up only 5% of all Arizona dwellings. But a new bill would put the power of an AC placement in the hands of the resident, not the landlord. Representative David Cook sponsored the bill. Well, to me, this is about keeping people safe, right? And we do live in the desert. I don't know who would object to air conditioning. If the bill becomes state law, Richard knows what he'll do. Put that AC front and center right where it belongs. Yes, because it definitely helped cool the house better and it was cheaper on my air conditioning. And a representative for mobile home park landlords say that they have brought up issues calling some ACs noisy and unsightly that can bring down the value of the mobile home park. We're going to keep an eye on that bill's progress.